guys, I'm Denzel. I'm the warehouse manager here at Apollo Scooters. What I really love about my job is that every day is different. Whether it's checking our inventory or performing repairs such as changing brake calipers, LCD throttles or motor controller, and most recently working on our newest scooter which is the Apollo Phantom. Every day is different. For someone who loves scooters like me, this is a great place to work. However, what I really love about working at Apollo Scooters is the freedom they give me to do my own personal R&D projects. I love to work on scooters and experiment with programmable boards such as the Raspberry Pi and the Arduino. My most recent project is an ultrasonic braking sensor and I can't wait to show you guys. I started working on this idea a few weeks ago. I thought it would be much safer to add this device on your scooter because it helps you know in advance when something stops ahead of you or shows up ahead of you. Imagine if you're riding in a busy road. Someone can suddenly walk in front of you, a car can suddenly brake, if it's a cyclist he or she can suddenly stop and you might not have enough time to apply your brakes. That is why I decided to add this ultrasonic sensor braking system to our scooter. The ultrasonic brake sensor is made up of three primary components. The first component is the ultrasonic sensor itself. It is a HCSR04 ultrasonic sensor module. The second component is an Arduino Uno. The third component is a 5 volt relay module. The Arduino sends a 5 volt signal to the trigger pin of the ultrasonic sensor and then in response the ultrasonic sensor sends out an ultrasonic wave. If the waves hit something, they will bounce back. The sensor will receive this wave and send a 5 volt signal back to the Arduino via the echo pin of the ultrasonic sensor. The Arduino uses the speed of sound, which is roughly 342 meters per second, and the time interval between the emitted sound wave and the reflected sound wave to calculate the distance between the object and the sensor. The actual equation is very simple. It is the speed of sound multiplied by the duration all together divided by two. Then we get the distance between the object in front of the sensor from the sensor. Now that I had the equation, I had to program the Arduino to cut off the power going to the motor whenever an object was detected in front of the sensor within a range of 2 cm up to 400 cm. I hope you guys enjoyed watching my R&D project. While I don't know when you guys can expect to see this ultrasonic brake sensor on one of our Apollo scooters, we are always striving for increased safety and I really think that this is a great innovation for the future of electric scooters.